guys happy Friday and yet again I'm lagging on videos and I do apologize I'm just really super busy with this fucking wedding that my cousin's having because I'm in it and I swear to god after this is all cleared up I should be like back on top of these videos because I'm not so because I wasn't on top of my videos I have a two for one for you guys on this week's so one this topic for this week is a uh, fatherhood and last week's topic was Pride, and I went to Pride, and I was supposed to edit all that shit. But for some reason, my editor on my phone was acting stupid. And then, like, like a lot of shit was going on that I should have fucking taken care of. Like, I'm getting ready to go back to school. And I'm just like, okay, I need to get all this shit fixed before I start making videos. Because I really want to be, like, here for you guys and, like, on this channel and on my main channel. And I start testosterone this month, and I'm just like, okay... You know, it's just, it's gonna be process. It's gonna be a fucking process, just believe me. Um, so, let's get right into it. So, I chose this week's topic for being fatherhood because the reason is we all eventually are gonna be there and we all eventually are gonna have to tell our kids that we're trans and it's gonna become up. It's gonna come up, it's a topic, that's the thing. And I just wanna explain what kind of father I, I wanna be because one, I was raised by my stepdad I already know he's not okay with the whole trans thing. He's not okay with the whole gays and LGBT community. And that's very hurtful. Um, so when I come out to them, I already know it's not going to be that. But the kind of parent I, I want to be and like the one person that I want to be with is you know, going to be a big factor in my life. Because I want my kids to know that they can come to me for anything and they shouldn't have to feel ashamed of who they are or what they've done. You know, people make mistakes and it's a human thing. And I don't want them to think that because... That they make a mistake, I'm gonna get mad at them. Of course, you know, there will be punishments depending on the mistake, but at the same time, I love them and it's not gonna change anything like that. It's just they'll always have to know that, you know, you made a mistake and now you gotta move forward and, you know, I'm not gonna punish them too harshly, but I'm not gonna punish them too lightly, if that makes sense. Uh, the type of father I wanna be, I really wanna be a big father figure in my, my kid's life, especially my sons uh, and my daughter also. You know, I want my daughter to know, like, she, you know, I know she's going to make mistakes. I want my son to know that I know he's going to make mistakes. I'm going to be there for them. Uh, whenever they need to talk to someone, whether it be friends or dating or any other thing like that, that I am the person that they can talk to. Not only am I their, their father, but I'm their best friend. And I only want the best for them. And I, I'm willing to put in this work for them to have the best and, you know, and just have a life that they can live and be happy with and that I would never ever 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 disown them or anything like that that they're always going to be a part of my life and they're really important to me and I want my kids to see that you know I don't want to be a deadbeat dad like that's for sure and I don't want to be like one of those dads that oh, I could have gone I could have went to college but I, I didn't cut thing I want my kids to know that I at least tried if, even if I don't complete school but I want to I want my kids to know that I at least fucking tried so I'm going back to school so I can get a degree at least. And I'm trying to make my, my music career my, my main career so that they know that I put in that work and that I tried. And even I'm, in the measly age of 22, I still put that work in to make sure that they had a good life. And that even though they, they have a good life, that they shouldn't take it for granted because there are kids out there and families out there that don't have a roof over their head or food in their mouths or clothes on their backs, shoes on their feet type stuff. I want them to be very humble. I want to teach them that being humble and staying chill is very, very important. You know, even though they have things and they're privileged, that they shouldn't treat people that are unprivileged as such. You know, they should treat them with the same respect as they would want to be treated. So thank you guys for watching that part. And now for the pride part. Hopefully you guys enjoy the video. I actually, my phone died in the middle of pride. Um, but I got some good videos of the parade. Um, I met, uh, Shay Mitchell was a bitch. I met her, but she was a bitch. Um, and I also met Amber's Closet. So you guys are going to see her in here. And that should be the boast of the video. I'll uh, see you guys next week with a new topic. And hopefully we'll be discussing it this week. And you guys have a great day. Bye. Hi, guys. And happy Friday. Uh, it's Devon. Um, so this week's topic is pride and i went to pride last week i went to la pride 
I went on Sunday, um, I got to see the parade, my phone actually died, so I only got a glimpse of a YouTuber and not much else, so I got to pull, try to pull some stuff on the internet, um, so you guys can kind of see about it, but what pride means to me is that, um, you are your authentic self, and you know, we've struggled through so many battles, oh, to be able to be who we are you know back in the day they'd be arrested just for being gay so like being able to be gay trans lesbian bisexual and you know celebrate who you are and not be able to be arrested for that and you know we do have had to thrive now we have nationwide gay marriage um you know no trans exclusion insurances now um you know little things that are happening here and there like when obama said that all the schools had to respect all trans people use the bathroom that they want so you know the things are moving progressively but it takes time and that's perfectly fine but that's why i like celebrate pride because i know who i am i'm happy to know who i am i found a community that we love each other and we celebrate our love with each other and how far we've come and our accomplishments as a community and that's what pride means to me so um i hope you guys like this video of my yeah pride and my girlfriend yeah <laughs> and i'll see you guys later hello guys and happy pride um so we're on our way right now we're just leaving her house say hi babe really? <laughs> she's doing her makeup right now so we're not gonna show her for like the first half but yeah i'm driving right now and i just left her house so yeah on our way to pride and I'm gonna meet up with some people and you guys are gonna see this. And that's our GPS right now. So it's gonna be pretty cool. Like look at this hat, it's lit as fuck. And then I wear my angels gear because well my team won last night, so why not? Cause street though was fucking up. But I can't I can't deny he got him two out, so alright. I'll see you guys when we get to Brad. Hello guys and welcome back to the vlog. Baby. We're trying to find a bathroom right now because we finally parked the car. It took us long enough because I kept trying to remember where I parked last year and I couldn't, but I figured it out. But everyone's over here dressed up to die for and rainbow flags everywhere. I love, 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 love Pride. Super excited. Outfit of the day. Y'all get to see that. But what are you doing? Alright, cool. So we're gonna do this stuff and I'll show you guys later. Bye. Yeah. So guys, we're at this place called, wait, I don't even have a thing up, it's called Hugo's. And there's my chai tea, and there's her tea, and it's her. And so we're gonna eat first, and then we're gonna go watch the pie break, so yeah. There she go, she's making it. Yeah, I'm not doing it, I don't know how I did it. Back it up, uh, 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 back it up. <laughs> <laughs> hey, this is my song. I love this song. There we go. Trans five guys. Got that.
Happy Pride! 